Hello, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 18. My friends, it is 6.30 on Wednesday, and I just got home, and it took me an, a little over an hour to get home tonight. We ended up getting a surprise storm with wind gusts and snow and ice and all the fun things. So literally took me an hour to get home and the end of the day was super stressful. So as you can tell, I'm very excited to vlog right now. Um, no, uh, yeah, I'm just happy that everyone got home safe that I know of <clears throat> and that, um, it looks like we'll have a white Christmas because it's supposed to be frigid from here on out so that snow is probably going nowhere. Came home and my black hunters that I ended up ordering at the cabin came today. So that's exciting stuff. I love them. If you don't know, or this is the first video you've ever watched, I absolutely love Hunter Chelsea boots. They are one of my favorite go-tos and I needed a pair of black ones, so I ordered them. And I will probably wear these bad boys tomorrow. I just think they're so cute. They're just my favorite shoe when it's rainy or snowy. Um, so I'm having some wine. I've not even touched advent calendars. It's just one of those nights. But it's Wednesday. That means it's Rapid Wednesday. So we're gonna wrap a gift. So the first thing I like to do is find a plain paper that has either some really cool texture or a really like plain design. So the one that I'm obsessed with this season comes from Target and it actually has the texture of like a cable knit sweater. So all I did is I measured it around my gift this way to make sure it fit. And then what I ended up doing was folding it on an angle and on that back side, just taping it down. Now, instead of using my whole roll of very expensive fancy paper, I've attached just a nice smaller piece of that paper I'm working with. And now we're gonna wrap this gift just like we would any package. Look how much paper I ended up being able to save of this expensive rifle paper company, but you still get the impact of it and it just looks so cute. Take this gray and white string. And I think sometimes people get intimidated to work with string. So watch how easy this is going to be. Going to take it on one side and just tie like the easiest little bow. Literally all I'm going to do, and I love the way this ends up looking, is I'm going to wrap it completely unevenly around. And then on this back side, I'm just going to tie this off on just one of the strings. By doing that, it makes it a lot easier to open in the future. And now I'm just going to space them out a little bit. And then last year, I saved some sprigs, which actually matches this paper perfectly. And I'm just gonna now weave that in the string. I absolutely love it. This might be my favorite wrap job this Christmas season so far. Once again, super easy. It's a great way to save this paper and use a cheaper paper from like just a big department store or a big roll and then save little sprigs and stuff. This is from last year and just add it in there. And I just think it's so stinking cute. And now I have another one of Steven's gifts already wrapped. I thought I'd give you a glimpse of like, look how much snow we actually got. Like that is deep and it is so ridiculously cold out. <sighs> But like you can see how deep it is. I mean, it's no joke. Steven is upstairs with the dogs right now. And I think they're all asleep. 
So I thought we'd quietly open advent calendars. And because it's so late, it's going to take me forever to get this to you. So let's go ahead and get these done. Pour some sugar on me. They are called sugar cookies. Teeny tiny sugar cookies dipped in white chocolate. I'm telling you, this is a good, good calendar. Where's day 18? I see 19. I see 17. Oh my gosh, it's this huge one right here. Oh my goodness, we got a strawberry conditioner. And our fun feminist fact is author, political activist, and suffragette Helen Keller was the first deafblind person to achieve a bachelor's degree in 1904. Helen is remembered as a disability activist and her life story was later adapted into an Oscar winning film. I see 18. I love these. So it's that pen that like changes all the different colors. I'm obsessed with this. Oh, there's actually something in it. It's little acrylic clothespins and a clothesline. That's actually cute for hanging little Polaroids on. What's super exciting is there are seven days until Christmas. So we can open our seven day self-care advent calendar. So I'm gonna open this one and well, let's open box number one. Your past is not your future. We got an essential oil roll-on to relax. That is really cool. It says roll-on at pulse points, breathe deep and feel calm. That's really cool. I'm really excited about this one. I heard the products in it are amazing. That's a cute one. It's a little smiley face. We got another shepherd in the house. Just check this out. Look how cute it is. I am loving, loving this nativity scene. Mary, Joseph, everyone is like living their best life right now. All the animals are accounted for. We got two wise men missing another. It's weird that these two showed up before the other. I thought they were all traveling together. They're terrible travel companions, but looking really, really good. Day 18 is a candle. Today was another amazing candle. Super excited about and that is advent calendar time. Because my commute was so tough, I already opened the ad wine advent calendar. It's a cab from California, but also look at my little Christmas case. Isn't that the cutest cell phone case ever for the holidays? I got it on Amazon. If I can find it, I'll link it down below, but it's really, really cute. And my little holiday wallpaper. I am going to, once again, cut this short, knowing that Friday's my last day of work and all attention can go to Vlogmas, which I'm super excited about. And I think it's been a good one. I mean, we wrapped a gift for taking an hour home in a snowstorm. Like, I'm okay with it. Um, Yeah, I'm going to sign off right here. Take care of yourself, take care of others, and be kind. Kindness is free. Give it to everyone. I love you all, and I will see you tomorrow.